Hello friends. Welcome to this channel, and today we are going to put a spotlight on how to use grid view in Android. Studio using Kotlin. For this, firstly you need to create a new Android Studio project in Kotlin. I already created an Android Studio project, and then add Recycler View and Material Dependencies in Build.Gradle file. Now create a new layout resource file used for Recycler View adapter. In this layout I add one image view which is used to show movies images, I already added some movies images in drawable folder. In this layout I add one image view which is used to show movies images, I already added some movies images in drawable folder. Now I add a text view, which is used to show movie name, I also set some text size, font color, text style, and margin. I also select an icon from vector assets and, add into image view. Now creates a new Kotlin class which is used for Recycler View Adapter. Extends the Recycler View Adapter class to this class, and then create View Holder class. And extend Recycler View Holder class to this class, and then implement all method like on Create View, on Bind View and Get Item Count method. In on create view method, inflate the recycler view layout, and then return view holder class. Now create the model class, and then define the variables. In get item count method return the size of list. Now defines the IDs of views, and then find in view holder class, and then set the data in onbind view method.
Now go to main activity layout file and add recycler view class, and also set ID. Now go to main activity class, and create a method which return an array list of movies data. Now create Grid Layout Manager for Recycler View, and add Span Count which you want. And then set Grid Layout Manager to Recycler View. Now set the Adapter to Recycler View. Here I add background to main linear layout which is used to animate layout when user clicks on the layout. Now I run the project in Android device. Thanks for watching us. Stay tuned, and please like and subscribe to never miss any updates.